Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Peep game. All right. So I just want to talk about the mayor of New York, uh, Mary Lake, New York, Eric Adams, and how basically um, I'm just keeping it 100. I think he a clown and he came across as a fraud. Now, all of a sudden, he's backtracking off what he had hinted and led people to believe. But we all know that he had some people you know whispering in his ear we all know he got phone calls because at the end of the day he can't be his own man he got to follow the script of the demon dummies who have one stand you know and that's the problem with people you know just because you are part of a group or whatever the case may be you don't have to always agree on everything you can agree to disagree and you know i know how it's, how it feels to have a difference of opinion when it comes to certain things and when you don't follow a script then people have an attitude towards you you know, there's sometimes where you can agree to disagree and be respectful about it. But then sometimes you have people, if they don't like what you have to say, then they try to demean you and try to dehumanize you and shit. And, you know, that's the funny thing about it. But at the end of the day, he the one that now all of a sudden he backtracking, hollering about, well, you know, I'm not going to do nothing. You know, keep in mind, this was to do before the New York uh, mayor election was official. He was hollering about, well, you know, if I'm elected mayor, um, I'm going to find a way for uh, Kyrie Irving to get back on the court. And don't be surprised if Kyrie Irving is back on the court by January. Now, all of a sudden, he's backtracked and reneged, hollering about, well, that's up to the NBA and, you know, and Kyrie Irving to figure something out. I think they'll be able to find some common ground and at the end of the day the dude is a coward and that's just the bottom line and i'm just gonna call it what it is and i'm not gonna backtrack i'm not backtracking i stand on what i say the dude is a coward and he a fraud you know what i'm saying had he not opened his big mouth and said nothing then i wouldn't you know you know i wouldn't have nothing to say if he would have just said from the gate well i don't know if i can do anything i'm just gonna but this dude was talking like hey i'm a you know, make some changes. And he's talking about, well, you know, I'm not going to change the current policies that we have in place, you know, as far as you know what goes. So, you know, at the end of the day, the dude get the middle finger from me because I'm just keeping it a buck. You know what I'm saying? I don't even respect what he did. It was weak what he did. And, and it's just kind of time to call the dude what he is. He's just a coward. And that's all it come down to. You know what I'm saying? Next time, you know what I'm saying? If you ain't going to walk the walk, don't talk the talk. Don't come come on alone talking that big boy talk. And then all of a sudden you backtrack and then you bitch up. So I just wanted to put that out there. This is your boy Town Biz. I'm out.